Hey everyone, uh, we got some exciting news to share with you. And in fact, we're not just going to share it with you, we are going to show you. We want to invite you along with us on a road trip to Kingston, where we're going to be meeting some fabulous folks from TriArt, who will be sponsoring us this summer and providing us with lots of wonderful creative materials to work with. So let's hit the road. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> The Living Room Community Art Studio is super excited to announce a new partnership with TriArt. They have very generously... Oh, wait, hang on a second. Something is making me feel like right now might be a good time to remind everyone that you can support us on Coffee or over on Canada Helps. Links in the description below. And our coffee page even has a really cool art shop with coloring books and pins and all sorts of stuff designed by local artists. It's great. Check it out. Thank you so much. Have a wonderful day. Okay, bus is filled up. Actually, only three quarters of the way up, but good enough to get us to Kingston. So now we hit the road for real. Right, try art. TriArt Manufacturing is a Kingston-based, family-run company that manufactures paints and other art supplies. They make acrylics, oils, inks, watercolors, tempras, and specialty paint lines for professionals as well as beginners, visual designers, and artisans. And they have very generously agreed to be our paint sponsor for our summer 2023 season. We're headed to their Kingston factory right now to meet up with some of the fine folks at TriArt and pick up all the wonderful donations. They'd mentioned that they wanted to get some photos of the bus and maybe talk to me for a bit for social media stuff, but I was not expecting to be greeted by a whole team of lovely, welcoming, amazing, art-loving folks who were super excited to see the bus. They had cameras and plans and energy, so we opened up the bus and I sat down for an interview with Melanie. We talked about the living room and the importance of art and how amazing it was that TriArt was supporting us. I may have got a bit emotional. <laughs> It hasn't been an easy time for arts organizations. Mm -hmm. And for an organization like ours that doesn't exclusively work with professional artists, that isn't considered a school or a gallery, uh, we work with people whose voices often don't matter. And people dismiss their creativity. Mm -hmm. So it's hard to find support. So when we reached out to you, when we reached out to TriArt, and you immediately responded, immediately, it was such a warm, and I know you couldn't say yes, well, everything, <laughs> but the fact that you responded, that you recognized us, that you saw us, that meant so much. So I can't thank you, and the team at TriArt, for taking a creative risk on us and seeing where this project with the living room takes you. So thank you. <laughs> you can watch the whole interview over on TriArt socials if you like. Links in the description. And then this really beautiful thing happened. They brought out some paints and canvases and we just sat on the bus and made art together. We shared stories and laughs and just painted the afternoon away. It's our first full season on the road with the Mobile Art Hive, and it's a lot of work keeping the living room up and running and out there in the community, so taking time to create art and make new friends in this way was something I hadn't known I needed so much. Another lovely gift from TriArt. <laughs> then, before I knew it, it was time to go, and they brought out boxes and boxes of amazing art supplies that we'll be using at all our events this summer, they wanted to make it look like a Wes Anderson film and I was on board for that. Can't wait to see their video. We loaded the boxes onto the bus, said our goodbyes, and a day I thought was only going to be about driving, picking up boxes and taking some photos, turned into something much more genuine and inspiring. Thank you, thank you so much. Wow. We came all the way to Kingston to meet the fabulous folks at TriArt and what a wonderful day. What a wonderful group of people who walk the walk and talk the talk. They've given us these fabulous donations to use with you, our community this summer. 
but they've also reminded me that we're not alone, that there are organizations out there that can stand behind us and champion us, and they want to be a part of inspiring you and helping people tell their stories in a creative way. So, what can I say? It's been a great day. Thank you, TriArt. Now, we have all these beautiful boxes to go home and unpack. So maybe we'll save that for another video. <laughs> See you soon, folks. And thank you, TriArt. Not a food truck, I'm so sorry. <laughs>